What is going on guys, Greggles TV. I'm gonna show you how to install Google Cam or G Cam, whatever you wanna call it, on your Galaxy Note 9 phone. And this is going to allow you to have basically the same camera app with camera features that the Pixel 3 and 3XL do, for the most part anyway. All right, so first thing you wanna do is click on the link in the description down below and it'll bring you to the same page that I am on. Once you are there, you're gonna see exact name of the application. You wanna click on that one where it says like MGC 6.1, that thing right there, click on that. It's gonna ask you to download it, so hit download. And then you're gonna see a download in here. It might take a little bit, it's a fairly big file. And then once it is downloaded, just click on it. And it's gonna ask you to install it. You might have to turn on unknown applications, so if you see that, just turn it on and then hit the back button, it'll bring you right back here. Then hit install. Now that it's installed, hit open. And you wanna hit allow to all this stuff. And you might think you're done, but you're not done. There's a bunch of settings we have to go through. And, and I didn't create this walkthrough, this other guy did by the name of Arnova 8G2. So uh, big ups to him, because it's pretty amazing that he figured out all this stuff. So once it's installed, you wanna go over to quick settings. So the way you're gonna get there is you're gonna go over to more, and then you're gonna go to settings. This brings you into quick settings. Then you wanna go down to advanced, and then click on base. And at the bottom here, you're gonna see back camera and front camera. Make sure both of them are Pixel 3 XL. So the back camera is already set to that. I'm gonna click on the front camera and change that to Pixel 3 XL. Then hit the back button. Go back into settings. Go back into advanced. And you're looking for final JPG quality. Click on that. And change it to 100%. Next, you're looking for Others. And under Others, you wanna enable Google Photo. Then tap on Fix at the very bottom. Click on Raw Format. And then choose Raw Sensor. Click on Viewfinder Format. And choose UUV42888. And check these as well, Black Level and Fix Old WB Gains. And then if you go back to that page that walks you through how to install this, step five tells you to install Google VR services, the latest version of it. And uh, I already have it installed and I, you can install it right from here. I, I don't have any issues with the camera. So I would just say to go to the Google Play Store, search for Google VR services and install it if it's not installed. And then go back to that same page and there's more, pay, there's more um, settings in here. You don't have to do these, but it's just really to improve your photos Overall, you could just close all your uh, apps here and open up the Google camera from your launcher in here. We'll just double check with it. There you go. So when I open this, all this stuff is gonna already work. Here's the camera. You can go to portrait mode, which is really cool with this camera. And then you can even go over to um, like Night Sight. All this stuff works really, really cool. If you have a really dark photo, you can go in here and take a photo and it'll brighten it up. Here's the portrait mode photo. It kind of put me in the background and put my camera at the forefront, which is kind of awkward. This is the regular photo. Now, if you want to do some of those goodies, I'll walk you through it. So go in here again, go into settings, click on advanced, and then go to portrait. And in here, you want to enable enhanced HDR+. Go down to, you see, night sight, enable alternative config. And you're only going to enable alternative config if you're on Android Pi or the Pi Beta like I am. Otherwise, you can just leave it. Click on libs. And click on the bottom one where it says custom by Esdman Sisus. <laughs> Hit the back button so that you go back into the camera and then swipe over again to more, go back into settings. And under quick settings, you're gonna see minimal smoothing, turn that on. And then that's it, just uh, hit the home button and go to your recent apps and then close all of those and then open up the camera again. And at the top here, if you want to enable HDR, just tap it at the top and you'll see HDR is on or off, or you can do enhanced. If you go into portrait mode, 
in the top left, you can click up here and you know make the face normal or face touching off. Or you can make it soft. So you can choose kind of what you want there. And you probably want to do that for the front camera as well. Uh, well, actually, it turns it off for both anyway. So that is it, guys. That is how you install Google Cam on your Galaxy Note 9. I hope that helped you out a ton and a bunch. Send me over some photos of your best photos taken with the Google Cam. Let me know if you think it's better than the regular Samsung camera app. Thanks for watching. We'll see you down the road. Peace.